field position here and our first look at Gerard Evans, the big quarterback in his first play is complete in his career. So that was a gain of 14 on the first play. You'll see a lot of this. 100 yards on the ground coming in. And as we mentioned, he's set to rewrite all the passing record in six from the Irish 39. And he's got some pressure here as that was on Wallow who cuts the ball loose. Evans is struggling with his ball handling. He bobbled the first snap. He, hit, he threw a poor ball that kind of slipped out. Been one of the best in a long time. And what a lot of times he can just put it up to that first read. And he puts it out there at the 30-yard line. And it's played tight end, did he? <laughs> He's a wide receiver in everybody's book now. He splits out there. He used to up and get it and take it away from smaller DBs. He's, he's a weapon. And this is a weapon. The game wrecker, Evans on the move. Little zone read, reads it well. Uh, Isaac Rochelle actually closed down. He reads that, pulls it, takes off, and he's going to lower his shoulder, get in the end zone. Five in his days at Virginia Tech. Justin Fuente instilling that tradition in honor of the former coach. And Carroll is driven back as Tyler Newsom hits a notes. And I'd always heard the story of the magical ring. And I, I told him that after four years, we'll see it. Uh, Doug, but a good story there. Jesse's gotten a little bit of playing time, but mostly, you know, on the sidelines cheering on the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. This is Sam, 16. And Evans begins trying to get out of this hole. With Notre Dame increases it to 24-7, and now it's third and 11. And Evans is going to try it on the ground and pick up the first. Neither. You've got to wrap him up. Evans, another high snap, able to handle it and gets it off out there in the flat to C.J. Carroll. So the Hokies at the 46, and they give it to Sam Rogers, the do-it-all. Lock rolling with three and a half minutes to go. Evans standing in, feels pressure, just floats it out of him. Another high snap. Evans able to handle that. He gets it to four. On first and 15, Evans with a quick toss over to Sam Rogers. And Rogers, yo, and guys downfield. RPO stands for run pass option. And this is Cam Phillips, who they call the vacuuming. So Virginia Tech pulling within three, beginning at its own 31, and they begin with his pen. So what will the Hokies do on second and three? They'll do that familiar jet sweep to Phillips, which has been so... And they go with Ford the other way. So they Phillips to the near side, Ford to the far side. Ford saw that as a sign that he went to Virginia Tech. Lofting it up toward Ford's way. In game 217 reception yards short of the school record in that department. This one is behind Phil. I mean, it starts moving on the way. I mean, there must have been a good gust of wind there. Empty set for Evans. Pass is caught at the third. And it goes to Phillips. And no call was made. Play went on without a review. And now Evans going deep down the middle of the field. It's off of the hands of Phillips and in the drought. No safety help. There he goes. Down the middle of the field. Perfectly thrown. And it's off the Which is so impressed with Drew Tranquil this year playing the best football of his life. Evans to the air on second and five. And a quick toss. Another first down taken in by Ford. Here with no one in the box. Fake it to Rodgers, and Evans goes across the middle. Another one complete. This time. Tech is getting looks that early in the game they were trying to run the ball against, but now they're just throwing against. And up the middle is good. Quick snap. And they're going to stop Marshawn Williams. Big play for the Hokies. Evans is going to get it himself. Good. Well, fourth down, line up quickly again and run another quick play. As a quarterback, I know sometimes you can get the defense where they're not lying. His last game at Notre Dame Stadium, trying to make it a W. And give it to Williams again, and he moves the pile. Look at Williams go. Come to the oh, wow. Virginia Tech is at the Irish 12 with a first and 10. Evans pass complete to Ford. Hokies can pick up a first down at the two-yard line on second and two. Evans looking for a hold. Evans will try it again, and this time he is stopped at the five. Designed run for Evans, and he's easily going to pick up the... On 
First and ten. Evans going for the deep ball. Cole Luke on forward in the slot. This is where Cole Luke's most comfortable in coverage, working out of the slot in the nickel position in the slot. On second and ten, this ball is caught, and it's Cam Phillips who reverses. And they give it to Marshawn, and he picks up the first down. If they Five, or 25. He started up in there, but once he bounces off and starts forward again, now... They give it to him again. Someone has been a non-participant in the Virginia Tech offense. And Evans trying to float it toward big threat running the ball down. Evans trying to find his man, Hodges. To the end of the first season has been at Virginia Tech. Now he's looking for a win on the road against Notre Dame. He starts this drive. And he's going to run this one and pick up the first down. Easily. And Evans goes to the right side. To Ford. And Ford's got another first down. 86 yards on the day for Ford. He goes to the other side now to Cam Phillips. And you're beginning well. And they fake it to Phillips. And there's Evans up the middle for as well in the top ten. Third and four. Evans has to run it. And he gets the. Have another tight one down to the wire again. Virginia Tech's Evans floating it. Looked like. Evans is going to run. Designed run all the way. Notre Dame is going to stop him. He's easy. He even cited Torrey Hunter and Josh Adams and others. So here is a Virginia Tech now here with a second down and 10. Trying to get that first down to salt this one away. 